What's up? Welcome back, everybody. Here we are at Fog Fest with Squash. Hey, guys. How about an introduction? My name's Kevin, and I play bass. My name's Rhett, and I play guitar. I'm Russell, and I also play guitar. I'm Jeff. I'm the drummer. The three of us have been playing together for about three, maybe four years now. Three, and three years, then yeah. we got this monster on the drums over here about January of 2017, and we've been under the name, really, Squash since then. I think we're maybe psychedelic rock, jam. We tend to extend our songs. We all have similarities of, of influences, but then we all have pretty big differences. It's like a common thread of some music that kind of weaves in and out through all of our inspirations, but at the same time, it blends really well, I feel like. I'm a little older than everyone, so that, that comes out too. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe we could talk a little bit about your guys' songwriting process and how you get it out. Somebody will bring something to the table. <laughs> yeah, and we're real methodical about it. We'll play it over and over and over again until we get the feeling, and then as, as Kevin said earlier, we'll take it and change it six weeks later to something completely 100% different. So I think it's ever evolving, but somebody will bring an idea to the table, the rest of us will start jiving on it a little bit and try not to force it somewhere uh, that it doesn't want to go. Right. I think we really try to not tell anybody no, you know what I mean, best we can. So to make it like, you know, that song could only be played by these four guys, you know, like that is a squash song. So I'll bring like an idea to the group and it might be totally different by the time we're done with it, but that's what makes it like the squash song. I don't think we ever play anything unless we're like all like, Right, right. Yeah. There's a good evolution from the beginning of the process to the end. As a band, what's the goal? We would really like to play a lot more in Savannah and in the area, you know, surrounding areas, and just be like a reliable, you know, a reliable, fun time. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, Savannah doesn't seem to have a, a jam band type scene, so we're hoping to get out there and kind of push that. Right. Yeah. And then ultimately moved into like the Charleston, Atlanta, Jacksonville kind of areas, play around Georgia, Carolinas, of course, but absolutely. Is there something that you see going on around today that where you would like to see change in the music industry? I feel like there's not as much patience anymore. The listeners, people don't give full albums a chance anymore. Like uh, the other day, people, I was talking to some younger guy, and he was like, I don't think I've ever listened to a full album or like dove into an album. It's just like the single of the week. And then it's done, I feel like. And I just, I don't know, there's so many albums that have impacted me. Right. Start to finish. What I would like to see changed in the scene would be uh, band collaboration. I think that the network, the strong musical network uh, that, that uh, you know, connected local musicians from this town and that town is, is depleting a little bit. I think people need to show share a lot more. People need to support other local uh, groups that are out there and, and tell people that what they do is appreciated. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> There's very little payoff. It's a lot of work. I mean, people don't. A lot of people don't realize the amount of time and effort it goes into just a band playing. It's not just a bunch of guys having fun for two hours on stage. Then they go home. There's the setup, the breakdown, the practice, the lifting, the carrying. And it's just you know, but it's worth it. It really is worth it. So expensive. Yeah, we wouldn't do it yeah. if it wasn't if right. it wasn't fun. That so. just shows yeah. how worth it it really is because the payout's not really yeah. that great. We're not making money. Yeah. <laughs> so pay us. <laughs> All right. We play for pizza. <laughs> Being that the four of us have <clears throat> four different sets of influences, and we continually challenge each other to think of the same thing in different ways. So as we talked about the, our songwriting process progressing over, over the weeks and practices that we, we do things, our musical style, uh, we bring a lot of different influences to band practices when we're all playing together, and we certainly challenge each other with rare ideas and, and things that we're, we're not comfortable with ourselves to, to grow as a whole. You're here.